Okay, this is a bench update, an all round update. It's a little bank holiday Monday project that I've decided to do with my good boy Jamie. And it's a little update on the, the big boy that I'm working on. As I said, I've been painting a lot of, a lot of tanks, so I thought I'd have a little break and start a little project that I've said I did for Jamie. So I need to make him a little base up. So he sent me um, one of the, the half tracks that he sent to Ringo from Rubicon Models because that's who he's working for at the moment and this is um, just going to be a little a little sort of display model for him for his, for his page and I'm more than happy to help him I'm interested in the kit I mean, I've, painted, I've painted a couple of these, I've painted Warlord one, I've painted this one and I don't I've painted, I've painted a lot of war, war, World War II scale, scale stuff I have so and there's a lot for you to use so it's always good to see um, the different ones. And instantly I like this one because you've got these roof options. I really like that. I mean, I've not painted them, so that's novel for me. So I'm going to do that. And this is the kind of little scene I've got laid out for you. Just dead simple. I've got some, um, just two seconds, just going to put some down. I've got some little posters which Waterloo sent me. And um, to go on propaganda posters for the wall I made, I'll cast a little wall up. And I'll paint up the Hanamag. I did like the idea of doing the um, ambulance. Sorry if I'm zooming around, but I'm just doing an overview like of everything. I did um, went into the ambulance, but Mr. Simkins is doing the ambulance, and he's got a classy idea for it. He's got a really good photo, so I'm going to let him go with that one. And another lad that's going to be done a good job. He did the Pioneer one, so I'm not going to do the Pioneer one because um, I think Andy Singleton done it, and I'm sure he'll done a pretty good job with it. Um, so I was just having a look through the instructions. I mean, you get all the different ones for the for the um, different variety. I mean, uh, the medic one looks sweet. I like the stretches in it and stuff. And there's quite a few options. You can have the doors open at the back, which is an interesting option. I was thinking maybe have a door. I would have a doors open on one. You could make a nice little diorama like that to have the doors open and, and stuff. It's a nice little feature. I think that if you want to make a little scale model. Diorama, not just as a play piece, you can kind of use it for that low like, because some people want to work in this scale. It's a fun, fun, quick one. That's what I'm going to use. Do now have a little make a tiny little diorama. Get a nice selection of decals, good decal sheet. And you got the sprues, you get free sprues with it. Do you know what I mean? Decent quality plastic. Look pretty cool. Plenty of options on there. As it says, I've not built it yet, so I'm going to build it. But it looks like it's going to go together now, problem. And you get little stretches. Nice box art. But the thing, as it says, the main thing that attracted me is these canopies. I love the canopies. I've not painted a canopy on a vehicle, so it's going to be interesting. You can see all the texture in it, it should be good for a shading. But I'm also going to add with this as well, because I've got this knocking around. Is um, an old, I bought this. When I was making the Normandy farm for um, our first game of bolt action, we all had. These are what John sent me, which were on that, so I'm going to use some of these on the wall. And surely I'm just going to utilise stuff I've got because I've got this, and so they haven't done much um, 28 mil wall gaming for a bit. I've just not had time. I actually love, love, love the period. So I'm going to probably drop some. Drop maybe that on the placker board on there as well, and I think there's a lamp post in there which I might throw on there and just make a nice little sort of roadside scene. There's drivers going past, have all this muddy to it's a little bit more. I might even throw some snow on there, but that's what I'm going to start on today. And then um, you can see that's that's the size of it. It's a shame I've got no more miniatures to put on it because I've just literally got rid of all my um, Russians, which is a shame. Would have been nice to have had a few minis to put on there. But um, I'm sure Jamie can add some miniatures to his end when I send it back to him. So, anyway, take care, folks. Just thought I'd um, give you my, my little update. And anyway, like this.